The past four years have been an absolutely incredible experience in every way, shape, and form. I have so many memories, so many friends, um, so much experience uh, to come out of this amazing university, and, and it's just surreal to think that it's over already, but hopefully this weekend is, is an exciting cap on, uh, on a very, very long journey. I transferred here two years ago, and it feels like I transferred here like a month ago. Like The time is absolutely flying by. I uh, really enjoyed the time that I spent here. The facilities at Syracuse for uh, athletics have been unbelievable and got me probably in the best condition of my life. In terms of graduating, it gets us on to the, the real world now. I'm very excited about the future. It's been a huge, a huge, 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 huge learning experience. I mean, I've, I would have never in a million years thought I would experience or learn half the stuff I learned. Um, and I also, it, it built self-confidence up a little bit because I was, if I was able to make it this far, I can make it do anything. So these last four years has been just incredible. I've learned so much and I've had so much fun and between lacrosse and getting into Newhouse and finding my passion of journalism, I've had a really great four years. I mean, it just takes time management. You gotta put your priorities first. So for me, that was always my studies. I was never a big party guy, so I always would make sure all my studying was done before I started to enjoy my free time. Now I have faith that whatever profession I go into, I have the confidence to do it and I'll be able to you know, prevail in anything I do. Sporting wise, I think it's uh, it's prepared me mentally about like how to how to play and things like that. I mean, obviously with the education, I've, I've grown up a lot since I've been here, and I've uh, really, I guess, matured in a way. But uh, I think I'm going to be good for the future. Like I really enjoyed Newhouse, and then you know, just getting to practice on time and lifting and running and everything. I've just really tried to um, make it all balance and work. And I think my four years here have taught me that I'm good at um, managing my time and making sure that everything works into my schedule. Well, my biggest thing is my leadership abilities. That's one thing that I want to carry over to the business world. Um, in addition, my time management skills. You know, football has given you that. You have to be on time for everything and just detail oriented. So those are all the things that you need in the real world. The size of the carrier dome is from, I'm from New Zealand, so the stadium is probably bigger than any stadium we have in the whole country. Things like that has uh, really surprised me about this place. And just the fact that I've been able to come here and get a good education and go back home with that is like a real honor. Well, I came from a very small small town and, and didn't really expect to, to flourish in a, in a bigger town. So I, I think I just put my mind to, to working extremely hard. Um, and doing my very best every single day and, and whatever came from that I would be happy with and, and you know fortunately a lot has come from it and um, you know, it, it, this experience has been amazing as a student athlete and, and Syracuse has made me work even harder for my dreams and my goals and, and it's just an amazing feeling, very humbling. We're all really good leaders and we just try and help the underclassmen as much as we can both on and off the field and we're not done yet so um, I think that we're going to try and show that all of our hard work after four years has paid off and hopefully paid off to a national championship.